What is up guys, it's Awana Turtle, and today we're doing a new Pokemon video uh, in our new setup. Um, let me know what your thoughts are, if, or if you notice any drop in quality. Uh, but today we're opening up another one of these Charizard GX, featuring the full art Charizard. Comes with a couple bo boosters from Burning, Le Burning Shadows, which is nice, so we're hunting for that Rainbow Rare Charizard. And in addition, we're actually doing, we have a mail day, very small mail day, and we have just one item, and it's really cool. It's another playmat from State Classy LLC. Uh, so we'll just look at that and uh, we'll start using that one for now on. Even though we really like our Selby Venusaur versus Pikachu Zekrom, this one is even better in my opinion. Uh, so we'll take a look at that and you can find a link to that product down below if you want to get your own. Shout out to Stay Classy LLC uh, for making these great play mats. All right, let's get into the opening. So let's just take a look at this play mat real quick. Uh, it's very nice quality and uh, all right so we have a Greninja Zorak so this is for some of the cards in Double Blaze a Greninja Zorak has a cool smell or right out the box versus Reshiram Charizard and this is kind of like what it looks like so you have Greninja Zorak and then Reshiram Charizard just absolutely amazing we'll take a top-down view uh, as well Okay, so we just set it up and we'll just take a quick look. Oh, this thing looks amazing. There we have Zorark and then Greninja getting ready his Water Shrikens. We have Reshiram using a fire attack on them and Charizard in the backup. Very cool signature. Uh, I can't tell what the name is. But yeah, from this is from Stay Classy LLC. Uh, they make just really nice uh, play mats, so definitely go check out that link down below if you're interested. And uh, if you do purchase one, give, uh, give give the give the channel a shout out. Just let them know uh, that you got sent here from from my channel. All right, let's get into this Charizard box. All right, let's get into this opening. So we do have the full art Charizard jumbo card. Uh, and actually where I got found this deal was on uh, actually Amazon however Costco is actually having a very similar sale that includes this box where you have get this as well as a pre marina box uh, for $30 so that's, I feel like that's a pretty good deal do have the full art Charizard as well Ooh, this thing is super beat up which is very unfortunate and like the Charmeleon one usually comes out a little bit better that one not so much the case this time as well as the Charmander Hollow. Very nice, here's a code card from the box. And then we have five, six packs. Um, we have two Burning Shadows, Guardians Rising, two Guardians Rising, Steam Siege, and Sun and Moon. So we'll start with this Steam Siege. So I'm not sure if that the Costco deal is available. However, every once in a while they have pretty good sales. Uh, oftentimes they have like Kind of like older tins um, so just something to look out for all right and I think I did catch a sneak peek at something I'm actually going to just whenever we change setup it takes a little bit to kind of organize all right let's see we got a Dewat Halucha a Aranoth, Mantine, Clink, Mankey, Fungus, Nidoran, that's pretty cool art. And then, ooh, we do have a break card in Pyroar Break. Breaks were interesting, um, <laughs> that's very funny, looks like Mario. Uh, interesting mechanic that I feel like there are just not enough of them were viable enough. Because when you think about it, it's almost just adding uh, another evolution, even though it doesn't evolve. So that combined with like the mega stuff, I feel like, you know, they just had to be really strong because there's just a lot of stuff that you had to do in order to uh, make that happen. All right, moving on to the sun and moon base. All right, we have a lightning energy, a lowland radicate, exp share, pelipper, cutie fly, drowsy, rowlet, torkoal, zubat, parasect reverse, and then a Crabominable. So, so far, uh, while we did get a break at least, uh, it's not that great. And actually, the last time we opened this box, we got pretty bad pulls. So I was really hoping to turn it around with this second box. However, uh, so far, not that great of a start. I feel like we're good to sneeze. 
<coughs> Alright, we have a Grass Energy, Watchdog, Weeping Bell, Multi Switch, Wishy Washy, Deli Bird, Mud Bray, Slowpoke, a Goomy, Altar of the Sun for the reverse, and then a Hunch Crow Regular Rare. Oh man. Rough stuff so far. We got three packs left for the box, as well as an additional Burning Shadows for our hunt for that Charizard. I feel like there's like um, a very big print run of not only Burning Shadows, but of these Charizard boxes. That's why we're, you see deals for them occasionally, because uh, otherwise it's a pretty old box. We do have a Dabbing Machop, Wellmer, oh, cute Stuffle. Stuffle's another one that whenever they print them, the art is usually pretty cute. A Pat Rat, and then we have a Got the Tell. Whew, it's all right. <laughs> oh, I knew that was coming, excuse me. All right, but if there's a pack that we did want to, to have uh, some super good pulls, it's definitely on Burning Shadows. This is where we want the fire openings, fire poles. Soul Rock, Escape Rope, Gloom, Lediba, Caterpie, Sandy Gas is so weird, Venipede, Sneasel, a Weavile, Reverse, and then we have, ooh, nice. Uh, so close to what we wanted, uh, you know, the the RNGs. Uh, close, but uh, we wanted a actually a little bit higher in rarity, but nonetheless, uh, very nice pull. We got our Charizard regular GX. So definitely a Charizard themed box. How many Charizards can we pull in a single Charizard box? That's the question. So far we have two, three if you count the jumbo card. And let's move on to our last pack of Burning Shadows. Can we find another Charizard from this box? All right, we have a Grass Energy, Tormenting Spray, Whirlipede, Guzma, nice. Cutie Fly, Dewpiter, Togemaru, Wimpod, Meowth, a Wobbuffet Reverse, and then a Araquanid. I think I pull him a lot. Alright, so we didn't get shut out. Pretty good opening overall. And let's get into our bonus Burning Shadows pack. I think this one, the code card might be facing a different direction. Yes, that's correct. Always tries to trick me. All right, for our last pack, let's get. We have Psychic Energy, Plumeria, Super Scoop Up, Guzma again, nice. Rhyhorn, Sandy Gas is so weird. Hoot Hoot, Tangela, a Dewpiter, a Shenotic, and then a Azu Merrill for the regular rare. Uh, so overall, between seven packs, um, we did get a very good GX. Like if you're just gonna get a regular GX, definitely that's the one to pull. However, um, I would say this is a average opening and we did get that break card which is uh, not a great hit but it's definitely better than nothing so um, solid opening um, as always guys if you did join that content be sure to hit that like button down below um, we're still hunting for that Charizard but I do think we'll get it eventually uh, let me know what your thoughts on the setup hopefully there's not too uh, there's no drop in quality uh, I feel like the lighting might be a little bit different and if you do notice that let me know in the comments below and if you want to get one of these play mats just follow this link down below and if you do buy one uh, I think they were like $26 um, so uh, as far as play mats go like for for a custom one like this it's it's pretty good um, but there there are play mats that are more mass produced that you can get cheaper uh, but the quality is very nice uh, so definitely shout out to L Stay Classy LLC and if you do buy one give uh, this channel a shout out um, other than that guys that's all we have for today I'm Moana Turtle and I'll catch you guys next time peace <laughs>